Hello everyone and welcome to Marvel Man's Game. Today we're going to be taking a look at the DC Direct Arkham Asylum Batman and Arkham Asylum Armored Batman. Now these two, he's supposed to come with a grapple hook, but I wasn't going to get it. But it, he does have a grapple hook and he has a bat ring. Those are the two accessories that these do come with. But we are just here to look at the figure so that we can do a comparison of this one and the McFarlane one. So let's take a look. So we'll start with my favorite version of Batman in the Arkham games. The armored variant, which never shows up again. Technically it does on the Wii U, I believe the Wii U version of Arkham City. You can play as the armored Batman, a armored Batman, not this specific one. But it does have like uh, electric gauntlets and stuff, which is pretty cool. Let's like a look at this, cause these are these are beautiful figures. Like these are mm, chef's kiss. They don't look a hundred percent like the games, like the faces don't, but like overall the just the, the just the detail on the figure itself is beautiful. Like he's got you see the plates down his neck, the armored plates. You can see all the detail in the armored plates. Even like the little blue part that's here on the gauntlets. Let's take a look at those feet. Now because these are the original DC Direct ones, they do not have a lot of articulation. It's a single hinge elbow, knee, and the legs move up and down, forward and back. That's about it. The head moves a little bit, but not too much. But overall, I really love these figures. I have the complete set of these ones, by the way. So let's look at base Batman. Oh yeah, they do have swivel at the um, forearm. Um, no wrist movement, but that's because of this. And, you know, they're older figures, so. Man, are they beautiful. Look at those. Oh, Just the detail. You can see, like, the little screws in his suit. Beautiful. The creases in his in his cowl right before the cape. Absolutely beautiful. Gauntlets look fantastic. Belt looks amazing. Oh yeah, they do have uh, uh, upper leg swivel as well too. But I mean, you don't really want to do that because like it doesn't really matter unless you want to do that and make it look a little better. But, you know, single hinge knees and elbows, same as the other one. But these are just beautiful figures. I love these figures. They look so close to the game, especially when the game first released, Arkham Asylum. Mm, beautiful. So, if you want to see me look at more of these and then the comparisons of the McFarlane and the DC Direct ones, like and subscribe, and I'll catch you all next time on Marvel Man's Game. Peace out.